Hello everyone. So today we'll learn how to install Strapi version 4 on your local machine. Uh, Strapi version 4 is currently in beta and they have recently released it. It has quite a lot of new improvement like they have introduced plugin APIs, Western GraphQL APIs with uh, flexible and consistent uh, API uh, best practices, uh, database query engine, error handling, all those sort of things. So I got intrigued with their um, release and I thought why not create a video to install a Strapi version 4 on your local machine. All right, so prerequisite. Um, start your map server on your local machine and get your MySQL running with all the details because you are going to need it. Uh, I'm going to uh, use MySQL, but you can always uh, use a quick start um, command and uh, utilize the normal SQL database, uh, which Strapi by default uses for um, demo purposes. But because I've been working with MySQL quite, for quite a long time, I prefer that database. Okay. So the next thing you need to do is you go to your uh, terminal, copy the command from here. And paste it here, and then I'm gonna name it Strapi version 4. Okay, so because I haven't uh, used the dash dash quick start, it will ask me how I want to go about it. So I'm gonna use custom because so I want to use a MySQL database. So I'm gonna go say MySQL. So now the database name. So I'm gonna go back to my map and I'm gonna click on my page link here um, and then I'll quickly go to databases here and then I say strappy version 4 create and there we go we got it so I'm gonna go back to my uh, terminal here and I say strappy version 4 then the host is local host then the port now remember everyone has a different port running with MySQL. Mine is triple eight nine, so I'm gonna use that. Then the username is root and the password I have is also root, so I'm gonna use the same. Enter. Uh, for now I don't want the SSL connection to be enabled, so I'm gonna say no. Now, as you can see, it's creating um, the whole uh, database options for us. Now, uh, it's downloading the dependencies, uh, which uh, Strapi version 4 needs. So we'll let it install, and then I'll fast forward it uh, to the point when we have uh, it's installed and running. Now, as you can see, uh, it has uh, installed everything. So we can... Uh, literally say go to the directory and inside the directory you can say yarn develop so yarn develop will uh, start uh, the server with um, watch mode so here we go this is the beta version for Strapi 4. So we'll quickly uh, register ourselves um, and say password. So here we go. All new interface of Strapi with Content Manager, uh, with Media Library, Plugins section, Marketplace section, and Settings section. So let's uh, go through the whole Strapi dashboard in the next video. If you like the video, give me a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel. Thank you.